host, Art Harris, who has dug up some brand new information. Art, what do you know tonight? Well, I can tell you, Jane, that uh, Misty crawls and is behind bars facing decades in prison if convicted of six felony counts of drug trafficking, selling, as you said, more than 300 pills from around town, resulting uh, her arrest resulting from a month-long investigation, uh, undercover investigation by a Tri-County Drug Task Force. Her husband, Ron Cummings, today meeting or talking to her mother spoke today, his mother spoke today, and said that he believes cops think Misty knows a lot more than she's been telling and that she will reveal what she does does know from behind bars. He thinks that she is going to say something at some point if she stays in jail. Well, Harris, there were people who saw her That's right. a few hours before, and isn't it true that one of the individuals arrested, Misty's brother, has admitted to police he went to the house that night at 10 o'clock, just when she said she'd already put the child to sleep and she was herself going to sleep. Banged on the banged door. Banged on the door, nobody there. Yeah, right. what, what do you, what's your theory about this relationship between uh, Ron and Misty? Well, I think it is a, uh, uh, as you said, it's sort of a love addiction. I think Ron likes young women underage. He has had three women in his life, uh, and they have all been young teenagers. Uh, Misty is number three. Uh, and, you know, he is very controlling, very manipulative, and, you know, he could get them to do anything he wanted, like babysitting. And now, when Misty flash forward, stumbled into this undercover drug ring and was making money, he jumps in on at least three of the deals. Allegedly, he's on tape helping her go get drugs and delivering them to the undercover officer. And they were making money. They were getting prescriptions uh, for like $30 for two prescription copay and then selling these 30 pills for $15 a piece. So if you don't have a job, and Ron was unemployed uh, uh, you know, for the last, uh, gosh, uh, for months and months, and Missy doesn't have a job, this is easy money. But and why would he lie about sleeping with Misty? What's the advantage? And if he's lying about that, what else could he be lying about? Well, you name it. Uh, I mean, this is somebody who, uh, uh, you know, who said initially he didn't do drugs, never smoked a joint, uh, didn't, you know, didn't, didn't uh, push women around. And, you know, on all those counts, Jane, I have spoken to uh, his, his, his ex-girlfriends who he had children by, and they all say this is an abuser. So. <laughs> You know, this is somebody who obviously is always blaming somebody else for all his problems. All right.